Hey, my name is Paul Blas. I'm a teacher and activities coordinator at Kaiser High School. I grew up in Mount Alua, and this place is very important to me. I'm proud and honored to be a teacher at Kaiser High School. Alua in Action came about from a conversation I've had with students for the past few years that we need to do a little more to celebrate the work that's being done in Mount Alua. New discoveries, in history. There are multiple organizations, nonprofits, groups, and individuals who do incredible work in the areas of conservation, sustainability, cultural preservation, and protection of the history here. And so, working with these organizations like Malama Mauna Lua and the Mauna Lua Fish Pond Heritage Center and the Bohoi Kahui and countless others, we thought it was about time to really celebrate the work that they do and bring students at all of our schools to their sites that they work with. So, 808 Cleanups, which we've worked with at Kaiser High School since 2013, usually in Ababa Malu, more popularly known probably these days as Alan Davis. 808 Cleanups hosted Kaiser High School and Ainhaina Elementary. Livable Hawaii Kaihui worked in Kalama Valley with uh, Elizabeth Riley and her team. They hosted Camilla Wiki. Mauna Lua Fish Pond Heritage Center run by Chris Kramer and his team. They hosted Hahayoni. Little Little Nursing Home also hosted Hahayoni. Uh, New Valley took their team of 200 students and family and teachers to Malama Mauna Lua, to Kulio'o and Paiko to work with invasive algae removal. And Coco Ed took their efforts to Bellows and Waimanalo to do a beach cleanup. All of these schools working together to learn more about conservation and stewardship and how important it is to give back to the community that we live in. My name is Ethan Yang. I'm a junior at Kaiser High School and a part of our student body leadership class. And on May 30th, we had our Aloha in Action event. So service and stewardship is so important in our community because it's all about giving back. You know, we all take so much, we all benefit so much from the community. So we all need to do our share of giving back. And whether it's just through connecting, making sure everyone's comfortable with each other and uplifting them, giving them advice, giving advice to the future generation, or you know, taking care of our environment through beach restoration. Uh, my name is John Kujo. I'm a student at Kaiser High School and I'm a junior. Uh, I'm here to give back to the community and help in the revival of native plants and really help like bring back what this once was. It was home for native animals that have been lost and we're trying to help them come home. I think I like that like everyone works together in our community. Like no one's really ever left out. We're really happy that this first year saw 250 participants from teachers to community leaders to just community members and of course students and their parents and their families. It was a really special event for us. We also want to thank the organizations that contributed to this successful event. Namely, we have Huli, run by Jesse Yonover and Austin Kino. Throughout the year, they take students from our different schools to be part of their Nanalua Future Navigators program. They take students out into the bay to learn about navigation on the water. They take them in valleys like Walupe and Pia uh, to learn about how what we do on land contributes to the health of our oceans. Their work, along with Chris Kramer from Mount Alua Fish Pond Heritage Center, they've created a map of all the historical and cultural places that exist in Mount Alua that also has a timeline of the history of this area, which is, I think, vital for people that live here and who visit to know about the importance and significance uh, the beauty of this place, of Mount Alua. I also want to thank Live Aloha, the organization has been around for a few decades. They do incredible work to bring awareness to how important it is to live with aloha and live through actions. I think that those two organizations really help to kind of navigate the why behind this project, that being a steward of the area that we live in is extremely important. I also want to thank the teachers and the coordinators of the different projects at all the schools. Working with them was a real joy to see that even though there was no blueprint for this, that this has never been done before, that people believed in it and knew that it was important to bring us together to act as a unified front. That everyone in, in Mount Alua has a responsibility to learn about this place and to be stewards of it. When it was all said and done, after the stewardship and service projects were over, we held a potluck here at Kaiser High School. Hanapa'a Market and Mala Market, both contributed to our potluck, donating a large amount of food for all of our families to enjoy. Aloha in Action was a team effort. There were uh, about a dozen students who worked on it. There's incredible students in leadership that were able to create the plan, 
reach out to all of or the organizations, host the meetings, collaborate effectively with multiple partners all around the community to make sure that this first event has little errors as possible. We, of course, we know that things are going to happen, but that team was incredible, very responsible and professional the whole way through. And I want to thank those individuals and that student body leadership for hosting this first event. The event took place on Saturday, March 30th, 2024. Uh, this being our first one, we're really excited to see months of work come to fruition. We definitely hope to have this event in the future. It was exciting to see how much could be done when different community organizations and schools work together under the same shared belief that we can be better stewards of Mount Alua. That Mount Alua is an important place. It's a place that's blessed us with incredible environment, a beautiful history, and a lot of great work that's being done every single day, everywhere. You know, whether it's uh, in the mountains, in the valleys, or it's in the Heiaus, or it's along the coastline. There's a lot that's being done in Mount Alua every day, and we're proud to be a part of it. As a coordinator of Kaiser High School, I've seen the value of partnerships and collaboration and working together. Our students at Kaiser serve throughout the year, different organizations all around Mount Alua and beyond. I know the importance of working together, of bringing in Kapuna and a family, different storytellers, different people who have something to share, some insight into Mount Alua and how it's doing. It's health, it's vibrance, it's vital to our learning. We have to get out there, we have to learn. We have to be stewards of our land. And we are, and great people are doing incredible work and continue to. I hope that Aloha in Action was the first of many, and we continue to build and strengthen the community of Mount Alua through our actions. New discoveries, in history. Please.